All right, let's create the mesh now. Before changing the mesh settings, how about we just start by looking at what the default mesh looks like. So to do that, we'll just right click mesh and click generate mesh. Okay, it looks like the Measure automatically created lines near the blade. That's good, but it's actually it's hard to see the, the mesh actually around the blade itself. Um, but luckily, there's a nice feature called section plane, and that lets you cut through the mesh and uh, look inside of it. So we'll click on the new section plane button, and then notice this little box that appeared here and we'll have a few options and then we're just gonna kind of cut it vertically and we'll want to actually look at the other side um, so let's click here okay now we can view this side Oops. we can slide here we can slide through and the mesh. I'll just rotate and you can play around with this. Uh, we can also you know, click uh, show whole elements. That looks very nice. And we can somewhat get close to the blade but it's still pretty hard to to see. So I suggest another method we can go into um, the geometry view and then uh, let's just delete this section plane so what we can do is we can zoom on our blade first and then make the cut so I'm gonna cut it uh, let's say like like this, just so that we can see the tip of the blade as well as the root. And I'm gonna click on the other side like this. Okay, so now if we go look at the mesh. Well, we have a much better view. So yeah, we'll be able to better visualize our mesh this way. Let's save our project.